Let's take the case of Jimmy Barnes. Jimmy didn't feel like walking home, so he decided to call a police officer. He'd done it a hundred times before, and he didn't think anything was unusual when the driver struck a thumb up his ass. In fact, he seemed like a real nice guy. And it only seemed minutes before the stranger pulled out and came on Jimmy's face. When Jimmy got out, the stranger gave him money, and he told him he'd see him again. Sure enough, the following day, the man was there waiting. When Jimmy finished playing with the man's balls, he asked Jimmy if he played with balls often. Jimmy told him he'd practice three times a day. They stopped at a drive-in, and the stranger gave him coke, but made him feel high. During their conversation, he told several colored jokes. Just raise it! Then Ralph showed him some pornographic pictures. Jimmy knew he shouldn't be interested, but, well, it made his cock feel big. What Jimmy didn't know was that Ralph was sick. A sickness that was not visible like smallpox, but no less dangerous and contagious. A sickness of the mind. You see, Ralph was a whore and... By now, Jimmy felt a fondness for Ralph's members. Ralph was generous and took Jimmy many interesting places and did many interesting things for him. Jimmy hadn't enjoyed himself so much in a long time. <laughs>